time I was up in the mountains in the high Himalayas. And I stayed in this little temple way up in the hills. And one night while I was sitting there, I heard this music. And um, I opened the door in my room, you know. But it didn't seem to be coming from the temple. So I walked out in the courtyard, and I realized that it was coming from this, outside the temple, there was this jungle kind of hill, a mountain. And um, chanting seemed to be coming from up there, so I kind of snuck out of the temple. Like I used to sneak out of school. And um, I made my way through the hills, up into the hill through the jungle, and uh, I saw there was this light on the top of the ridge. So I walked towards it. As I got closer, I saw that it was that there was a hut there, and inside the hut there was this fire. It must have been a fire. And um, and, um, and that's where the chanting was coming from. So I kind of eased my way up, you know, and I, I stopped outside the hut, way outside the hut. But all of a sudden, the chanting stopped. Because <laughs> it was obviously some kind of, you know, yogi, some kind of baba in this hut. And, you know, they could fry you, like, with one look. <laughs> you know, oh, that, see that pile of ashes that used to be Christian? So I didn't want to disturb him, but there it was. So this big booming voice went like, who's there? <laughs> OK, it's just me. And uh, what do you want? I said, Baba, I'm really sorry to disturb you. I just couldn't resist coming to hear the chant more closely. It was so beautiful. Mm. Come in. <laughs> Terrific. <laughs> so I walked up to the, the front door of the hut. It's just an open door. And there was this baba, those long, you know, that hair, like ropes, covered with ashes, totally naked, covered with ashes. His eyes were like burning coals. And he was 20 feet tall sitting down. I went, sit. Great. So I sat down opposite the fire. And he just checked me out, you know. <laughs> then he says, what do you want? I said, Baba, I'm sorry I disturbed you, but if there's any way you could teach me this chant, you know, I would just love it. Mm. OK. And he smiled. That's good. So this is the jam. <laughs> Wherever he is, may he be happy. So, you know, it's in a foreign language, so I'm <clears throat>
Thank you.